We got five today. We got Amazon, Blu rays for everyone.com, and eBay. How's everybody doing today? Tommy Sawyer here. Thank you for clicking on this video. And uh, we got some more unboxing fun for you. Um, so, yeah, like I said, five packages today. Um, the Amazon package here, which is this big one here, uh, this is, uh, a, it's two, a couple movies that I wanted to get on Blu-ray, um, for a while, and then there's a still book in here that, uh, is a brand new still book that just got released, and it's pretty badass looking, so I'm excited to, uh, to check it out. And then, uh, we got a blu ray for everyone.com, which is right here, a couple slip covers that I ordered, um, that I'm pretty excited about, um. And then just some other random stuff. So let's go ahead and let's uh, crack into these boxes and see what we have today. We'll go ahead and start with blu rays for everyone.com. Um, so we got a Disney slip in here that I've been after for a while. It's basically the last slip that I needed for every single Disney title that I have right now. So after, as of now, with this slip, I have every... Every one of my Disney's have slip now, slips now. So, pretty awesome. And then the second slip that's in here is another slip that I've just been after for a while. Um, it's a, one of those, uh, what are they called, Fox Icon slips. And uh, recently when um, Walmart just, you know, recently brought back a lot of those uh, slip covers, um, they brought back uh, mostly DVDs. Um, and a few Blu-rays, uh, but uh, the, this particular one they, they brought back for DVD only at Walmart, you know, in the last couple months, and they didn't have um, this on Blu-ray, just DVD. So I was kind of bummed out because I've wanted this slip for a long time, and finally now I got it. So let's go ahead and get in here and see what we got. Okay. Okay, here we go. Let's see what's in here. And Blu-rays for everyone.com, they always really take care of their slip covers. I mean, they package them up well in cardboard, and uh, they always put plastic around them. So, here we go. And, yep, they're both here. Well, only one of them have plastic. This one doesn't, but here it is. Here's the Fox Icon slip for Office Space. Check that out. <laughs> I've been after this for a very long time. Just love it. It's so cool looking. I, I, I'm a big fan of these Fox Icon um, slipcovers. Here's, here's a look at the back. I don't know how well you guys can see that, but I love it. I'm so happy to finally have this slipcover. And then the Disney one I needed. This isn't in the greatest condition. Kind of bum. Kind of bum. Bleh. Bumming me out here. Um, let's get this opened up. I didn't even know. I mean, apparently, I, I think all Disney have slipcovers. I'm pretty sure. But this is one I didn't think had one. But it, it apparently does. So Here we go. Mickey's Christmas Carol. Um, yeah, it definitely has some damage on here. It's kind of like up in the corners. Looks like just maybe shelfware. Yeah, this isn't the greatest. I think I paid a little bit too much for a, a slipcover in this type of condition. blu rays for everyone.com is usually pretty good. Their slipcovers are great, but eh, this one's got a lot of wear in the corners. That's not good. But anyway, there it is. One of my favorite Christmas cartoons of all time. If not my favorite. So yeah, blu rays for everyone.com. They're okay prices for the most part. Um, but every now and then I'll I'll order something off them just to, you know, if, if it's a slip cover that I've been looking for for a while, um, I'll uh, I'll grab it off there if I can't find it anywhere else. But on to the next box. All right, I think we'll do this one next year. Uh, I believe this is eBay. Um, so let's go ahead and crack her open. Another Disney title that uh, that I've been uh, 
needing to get for a while. I mean, this is just one of those classic ones that if you're collecting Disney, you have to have this one. So. All right. Here we go. Take a look at the slip cover. Yeah, this one's got some damage too. Bummer. Well, here you go, everybody. Lady and the Tramp. Um, like I said, classic Disney title. I needed to have this one. Found it for uh, a good price. Um, there's the back. Um, let's take a look at the inside here. And we have a disc flying around. The DVD disc looks pretty rough. Let's take a look at the Blu-ray disc. Doesn't look too bad, I guess. I don't know. You always take a chance when you buy stuff used. Looks okay, I guess. Um, the subcover looks good. I mean, it looks like just up at the top here. You guys can see that in the corner there. A little bit of wear, but otherwise okay. Definitely, like I said, a Disney title I needed to get. Lady and the Tramp. All right. Moving on. Okay, so these next two are um, a couple movies that I needed to complete a collection of, uh, of movies on Blu-ray. Um, I was out at... Uh, there's six movies total in this franchise, and I found one, uh, one, two, and three, and part five when I was Blu-ray hunting one day. So I needed to get part four and part six. So we'll go ahead and uh, we'll do this one. This is, uh, I, and they're, they're both off eBay, so. Not, I mean, I'm not a, like a humongous fan of this franchise, but uh, the movies are still decent. Okay. Again, we have a really bad looking slipcover. Ugh, this is like the worst one yet. Jesus. Here you go. Paranormal Activity Ghost Dimension. This is part six in the franchise. Um, or, I don't know if you want to call it part five, technically. Because I think part... Um, what is it? Uh, the Marked Ones. Uh, it's, supposed to, it's not technically supposed to be part of the series. It's more of a spinoff, I guess. I don't know. I call it part five. I call this part six. But anyways, look at the slipcover, you guys. Not good at all. See all the corners. I mean, it's not like a really important movie that I wanted a really good slipcover for, like like Disney and Scream Factory. But, I mean, at least I got a slipcover. <laughs> it might not be the greatest condition. But. Uh, it says it comes with Blu-ray and DVD, and we don't have a DVD in here. Probably why it was so cheap. At least we got the Blu-ray, because that's all that matters. All right, well, so I got Paranormal Activity Ghost Dimension, part six. All right, two more boxes. Now to this go. one should be uh, part four, I believe. So go ahead and do this one now. And this is supposed to have a slipcover too, and it does. Okay. Hopefully, this is in better condition. definitely looks better, thank thankfully. <laughs> Alright, Paranormal Activity 4. Now I got all six. Yeah, looks good. Let's make sure we got everything in here. Yep, we got DVD and Blu-ray. So, alright. So it's cool that I have all the Paranormal films on Blu-ray now. That's awesome. All six. Like I said, not a huge fan of these movies. Uh, the first three are kind of fun. But, there we go. Now I got the whole series. Cool. All right, on to the Amazon box. Okay, so let's go ahead and do it. Like I said, this still book that's in here, I'm uh, pretty excited about. Um, like I said, it's a brand new still book that just got released. So I'm excited. Okay, and there's two other items in here, so I'll go ahead and show you those first. Um, so the first item in here is 
Sharknado 1 through 3. Um, this is the, uh, um, like, a, you know, the Sharknado 3 pack. Um, I was thinking about getting them all individual, but uh, to sh save some space and to uh, save a little bit of money, I just went with a 3 pack. Um, big fan of these movies. Uh, probably the cheesiest horror horror movies out there, but uh, I really like them. They're, they're, they're a lot of fun. Part 5 just came out. And I picked that up in my last shopping video, if you guys remember. Um, and uh, so I, I had one through four on DVD, but I, I since I, I had to upgrade these to Blu-ray. I mean, I just had to. So now I got all five on Blu-ray. But here's one through three, and then here's number four, The Fourth Awakens. So, yep, got all five Sharknadoes now on Blu-ray. I haven't even seen this one yet. I've seen the first three. I've never seen part four and I've never seen part five. So I'm looking forward to uh, to checking it out for sure. So awesome. All right. So now for the steel book. Here we go. I'm trying to remember now who released this. Um, Mill Creek, I guess. Um, but anyways, here you go, you guys. Flatliners. Like I said, it ju this still book just came out uh, like a week or two ago. Um, and I uh, had it pre-ordered through uh, Amazon. Um, it looks like it's got one of those clear slip cases, slip covers over it. I really like this movie. It's it's re a really neat movie. If you guys have never seen this, Kiefer Sutherland, Julia Roberts, Kevin Bacon, Oliver Platt. Um, you get a really good uh, cast in here. Uh, but just a really cool movie about these... Uh, these group of like students uh, at this uh, university or whatever, um, they want to basically see what happens after you die. So they uh, they do this type experiment type thing where they uh, they basically kill each other, and uh, so you they can see um, you know what happens when you die, and then they they bring them back, uh, you know they revive them. Um, but, uh, it's, it's really cool. I mean, once they start seeing what happens after they die, you know, shit starts going crazy. And, um, it, it's, it's a really good movie. And this is a really cool looking steel book that I'm, I'm really happy to have, uh, picked up. Um, but, uh, you know, in my next Blu-ray update, you guys will see what this looks like on the inside and outside and whatnot. But there we go. Flatliners. Awesome. All right, here book. you go. Our pickups for this unboxing, we got ourselves a still book, a few horror uh, films to complete a few franchises of mine. We got a Disney title and a couple of slipcovers. So, yeah, great unboxing. Uh, anyways, that'll about wrap it up for this unboxing. Thank you so much for watching. If you guys enjoy my unboxing, unboxing videos, <sighs> anyway, if you enjoy my unboxing videos, give it a thumbs up. Just hit that like button right down below. Drop me a comment. Let me know what you guys think of the pickups. And uh, share the video around. Subscribe if you have not. See you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.